Hello again my friends, you're about to see some more exclusive Destiny gameplay that I captured during my time at Gamescom. I was allowed to replay the Dark Beyond Moon mission, but this time I got to use some rare and legendary weapons. Now, in this video, you'll see me use the Crypt Dweller SR1, a legendary scout rifle. Its description reads, a marksman's weapon modified by Dead Orbit's superb technicians and specialists. You'll also see me use the Light to Beware, a legendary fusion rifle. Now, many of you guys have asked me why all the rare and legendary weapons that I equipped during my time at Gamescom only had a 48 attack level. Well, it's highly likely that these weapons were capped for the beta. It's cool to see how they look and handle in-game, but they don't appear to give us a true demonstration of their damage dealing capabilities. So then, this video starts with me entering Hellmouth. Now, I didn't have much time to capture gameplay during the event, which is why all the videos you've seen from Gamescom finish at rather random moments. I kinda had to rush through things in order to make sure I got to show you guys as many rare and legendary weapons as I could. So apologies for the less than stellar gameplay. And I also wanted to take this time to let you guys know that I'm flying out to Seattle on Wednesday, August 27th for a special event. I'll be able to tell you exactly what's going down soon. So the next video you'll see on this channel will be a vlog of me giving you guys a tour of my hotel room and updating you of what's to come. I also wanted to say a massive thank you for your continued support of this channel. You guys have made this a year I'll never forget. Thumbs up if you enjoyed the video, subscribe for daily Destiny content and thanks for watching you beautiful bastards. Enjoy the rest of the gameplay and as always, we'll speak again soon.